Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a Chevy Suburban that is a monster of a vehicle that's going to take maximum effort to return to a like new condition. The owner's children have done quite a number in the rear of this vehicle, but with the tools at my disposal, I'm confident that can bring it back to life. As I get into the cleanup, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Each of these helps every content creator in a huge way to help clean up the one piece of filth that I haven't been able to polish yet, that dreaded YouTube algorithm. The first step is to remove these wonderful WeatherTech floor mats. Again, not a sponsor. These things are really a lifesaver in Minnesota during the cold winter months, which we are just getting into. Mother Nature's been getting after us early up north this November, so I wasn't able to do an exterior wash on this vehicle. Now, I didn't have to remove the seats in the vehicle as the floor mats did a wonderful job of protecting the carpet under the front row and the middle seats you'll see fold up nicely so that I'm able to get cleaned up under them as well. The carpet in this Chevy was not too bad, so the vacuuming stage went really well. In fact, the floor mats did such a great job I didn't have to use the extractor at all during this detail. Now, I know, I know, that's disappointing to a lot of people, as that was voted the favorite part of my details, but don't worry, my next video is on a completely disgusting Pontiac vibe, and that's got enough extractions in it to cover you for a month. I know everybody loves a good extraction, but one real nice thing about these leather slash vinyl seats is I can spray it with my Car Pro inside, use my horsehair brush to loosen up the oils and grime. Then I'll wipe everything down with a microfiber towel. This gray color hides the dirt really well, so the seats don't look too dirty when I start, but the residue on the towels after wiping them down tell a different story. I've had some people message me asking where I get my towels and I don't have them linked below. I actually just buy mine at Costco. They're good quality towels at a reasonable price. This pink stain was the only spot on the seats that I was just not able to remove. It looks like a marker was left to seep into the vinyl and has permanently stained. With the seats clean, I turned my attention to the dusty trim. In a Suburban, there is an incredible amount of it that needs to be cleaned. It seems like a never-ending supply of plastic and vinyl surface area that needs to be sprayed, agitated, and wiped down. But my Car Pro Inside Cleaner is absolutely fantastic. It removes the oils and dirt and prepares the surfaces to be treated with UV protection. Now to clean these wonderful WeatherTech floor mats. Like I said in the beginning of the video, Mother Nature threw below freezing temperatures at us and I had to clean this in the shop with my APC and a microfiber towel. It was no problem though as I was able to bring these things back to life. With the trim properly cleaned of all the dust, it's time to restore it and give it some UV protection. My product of choice is 303 Aerospace Protectant. It's an easy product to use as you just spray some on a microfiber applicator and wipe down all your surfaces. It restores and protects your plastic and vinyl. Such a simple step, but one that so many daily drivers neglect. Just look at how it brings this plastic and vinyl back to life in this Suburban.
For the vinyl slash leather seats, I'm using some Lexol leather conditioner to make them soft and supple again. The final step is to clean the glass and give it that finished look. And like I said with the trim, there's a lot of windows in these Suburbans. This vehicle turned out absolutely fantastic. The trim shines like new and the seats are soft and supple again. Don't forget to comment below, pound the thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you are notified when I release my videos. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Until then, keep it clean.